Good evening, y'all. This is Julie Atwell, the Ninja Oiler, and tonight we are doing the Art of Essential Oils class, one of my favorites. I absolutely love this class. So much rich, rich history with essential oils. So much art goes into distillation, and I'm just thrilled to be able to share that with you tonight. So without further ado, let's get started. So obviously, <laughs> I'm not a doctor or physician, so this is purely for educational purposes. I cannot diagnose, treat, prescribe, cure, disease, or any of that kind of stuff. So if you are really trying to work on something, um, a serious disease, illness, or injury, please consult your physician. Okay, I really want to empower and encourage you and share great resources so you can do your research and make the best decision that you can make for your wellness journey. So my long, Young Living story started about six, almost six years ago. And before that, my wellness journey started about nine years ago. The reason that my wellness journey started was because my son had some digestion issues. I had no idea that food is pretty much the primary source of so many things that we're afflicted with today. What you put in and on your body affects your health. It will actually determine your health in 90 to 95% of the cases. So I didn't know anything about food, eating clean, eating healthy. I knew I should, but didn't know how to go about it and wasn't really that important. Yes, it actually is everything. And so I started on this wellness journey. First, we cleaned our, our, our food, um, eating habits. We ate the standard American diet and we cleaned up all the junk and got rid of that standard American diet, the sad diet, and started eating clean. And I cannot tell you, first of all, my son was... Uh, relieved of all of his um, issues and within two weeks. So it only took two weeks for that to happen. And then secondly, it started me on a journey to read everything that I could about natural resources for food, natural, clean, pure uh, resources to use for my family's health and wellness. And Along that journey, I discovered Young Living because once we were starting to eat clean, certainly didn't want to dump in a bunch of junk in, uh, in the way of pharmaceuticals, in the way of uh, different products, personal products around my house, my cleaning products, all that other kind of stuff that puts a toxic load on our bodies each and every day. I didn't want any of that. It would totally undermine all the work that we were doing for eating clean. So when I discovered Young Living, it was like a godsend because they cover everything from head to toe as far as wellness goes. And I was thrilled. I was so excited to do one-stop shopping and be able to trust a company um, that would be able to deliver pure products. So. That's my Young Living story. That is why I'm here today. I made a total career change because I am so passionate about sharing um, these uh, products and what you can do in your own home is limitless when it comes to essential oils. So let's move on. Okay, I love, this is one of my favorite photos of our founder. That's Gary Young over there. And this photo was taken at the Highland Flats Farm and Distillery in Idaho. This was taken by our current president. And I love this because our founder is, he, he was one of a kind. Uh, I can't say enough about this man. He truly is the father of modern day distillation. He is the one who is responsible for bringing essential oils to the United States. And he has done extensive research and studied all around the world and has built this amazing billion dollar company. So he's just an amazing man. And I'm going to read actually from our president when this was taken, okay? And this, this picture um, of Gary um, was taken, like I said, at the Highland Flats Farm. And they had harvested balsam fir and blue spruce all day. And they were sitting down for dinner, but they couldn't find Gary. So uh, Jared Turner, 
um, volunteered to go looking for him. And he looked all over the camp and looked out a camp window and saw a faint light coming from the distillery. I threw on my snow boots and he threw on his snow boots and trudged out through the deep snow to the distillery. And once there, he looked down the stairs to, to where the oil condensers descend to the oil separators. And that's why I saw Gary just sitting there on an oil barrel with a little smile on his face as he stared at the last drops of oil bubbling up through the separator. He knew instantly it was a special moment in a sacred space. It captured the essence of Gary. That is so true. <laughs> so true. So distillation is uh, something that very uh, few in this country or even the world know how to do extremely well. It is, it is, an, there is an art to it uh, for sure. And if you distill a, um, a plant material at the wrong temperature or you harvest the plant at the wrong time and then try and distill it, there is a good chance that so many of the constituents that make up that plant are going to be lost. There is a definite art to it. So I truly appreciate uh, that Gary has searched all over the world for different plant material and, and, and research, can it be distilled? I mean, they're still making discoveries of plants that can be distilled. So they do come from shrubs, flowers, trees, roots, bushes, fruit, rinds, resins, and herbs. So many different kinds, but not every plant has, has an essential oil. We're gonna watch a short video by Dr. David Stewart. He is the author of uh, quite a few books, but um, most of my favorite is The Chemistry of Essential Oils. So we're gonna hear from him. If somebody asks you, what will an oil do? You can say, well, that's uh, oregano and it's got phenylpropanoids in it. And it's got this and it cleanses your receptor sites and, and it does various things. And you can give them a chemical answer and that would be a good answer. But the truth is that oil has hundreds of compounds in it. And so if somebody asks you, what will that oil do? You can give them a quantum physics answer and say, what do you want it to do? Because it's just a packet of possibilities. It's really fascinating that we have the molecular science and the understanding today how essential oils do work on a molecular level. That takes away this kind of voodoo feeling and snake oil feeling because now I can really stand there and say, look, I understand what this oil is doing in the brain. I understand what this oil is doing with the cancer cell. Molecular shapes and sizes of the molecules of essential oils are so compatible with our human body and that they fit the receptor sites on the cells so perfectly. So to me, that means that these oils who fit us so well and were created before we were created, that God was thinking ahead and thinking of our well-being before he ever cooled. Thank you, Dr. David Stewart. I love that. And also, if you have not heard of Healing Oils of the Bible or seen the movie Ancient Secrets um, of Essential Oils, those are two that you need to write down and make sure you get your hands on. They're really cool. Okay, so the history of essential oils. So essential oils have been around forever. They've been referenced in Egyptian hieroglyphics, Chinese manuscripts, of course the Holy Bible, mentioned more times than you can even imagine in the Holy Bible, Native American teachings. So really the pharmaceuticals are the new kids on the block and essential oils have been around, like Dr. David Stewart said, since the beginning in time. So this is a, this is obviously an older video, but this is Gary Young talking about sacred frankincense. It's great to be back in Salal Oman at the Young Living Frankincense Farm and Distillery and to be standing here in front of one of our frankincense trees on the farm. And it's just starting to go into full bud, which will be in flower in January, February. The flowers are so exquisitely beautiful. It's just amazing. We just finished the resin harvest a few weeks ago, 
And now we're, and have been for several months, busy distilling the Boswellia Sacra, the sacred frankincense. Now we'll go to our distillery. It's really exciting to be able to share this with you, the installation of our second distillery we just installed a few weeks ago, and our new condenser, which I'm really excited about. It's a configuration taking a stainless steel coil that is designed like a radiator and coiling it into the condenser, running the water through. It allows the separation from going from the gas phase to liquid phase to travel slower, cool at a more efficient exchange rate, and we're seeing a greater separation from the hydrosol to where we're getting almost 100% recovery of the oil from the water. Frankincense is growing and our production here is growing every day. But with Young Living, we don't just talk about oils and we don't just talk about our production and marking them. We go to the mountains, we go to the trees, we gather our own resin. We bring it here to our distillery in Salala and we do our own distillation. And here we're looking at the golden hued resin that we gather in the Alhasic Mountains in central Oman and bring here to our distillery. That's why Young Living is the world leader, because we're the only ones that go to the source and distill it. And also, we have the laboratories for analyzing it. But folks, this is the haujuri, which has been referred to as the holy frankincense. We call it sacred frankincense, the greatest frankincense in the world, the purest in the world. And in years past, only the royal families could have possession of it as a resin. We know without question that we produce the finest quality oil in the world. That's why Young Living is the world leader of essential oils and always will be. So I love that video. Uh, we are the exclusive company that is allowed to go into Oman and harvest a sacred frankincense. That is because Gary Young forged a beautiful relationship with the sheik there and uh, was able to minister to his family. So it is a huge privilege and I am so excited about Young Living Sacred Frankincense. It is amazing, absolutely amazing. Okay, let's move on to the three schools of aromatherapy. So today there are really uh, the German school, the English, the French. Um, the German school emphasizes inhalation as the best way to receive the benefits of essential oils. Inhalation puts those oil molecules di directly into the bloodstream and brain, which is absolutely amazing. The English school, the skin is really the primary organ of absorption for essential oils. They are applied diluted in a carrier oil and in very low concentrations. Now the French emphasize taking essential oils orally, but also practice the other methods as well. They inhale, apply to skin, ingest as a dietary supplement, and cook with them. Young Living has really adopted the French school and practices all of these methods. Okay, so there are different grades of essential oils. You know, I have used essential oils for quite a while now. And I've had the opportunity to check out all sorts of oils, including like the $4 vial of lavender that you can get online or at your local farmer's market or health food store. And in the United States, there's really no rating system for essential oils. So you have to know your source. You have to know where it is coming from. And if you do need a really good comparison chart I highly recommend you going to Jen O'Sullivan. She has an amazing comparison chart that she spent uh, a few years actually putting together uh, all the research. It has many different categories and it clearly shows who has done, clearly shows who has done the most uh, research and um, who has the purest product. So highly recommend doing that. Okay. so. Uh, the ther therapeutic grade, th those are the ones that are young living, okay? They are made from organically grown plants and are distilled at very low temperatures. The grade B1s, that's really the 
uh, food grade and they can be labeled as natural. They often contain synthetics, pesticides, fertilizers, chemical extenders, or even carrier oils. And they're gray CR perfume oils, and these really have adulterated chemicals in them. They usually have uh, used solvents such as hexane to gain a higher yield of oil per harvest. And the hexane is, is a known carcinogen. So, um, and this is in many of the store-bought oils, okay? Perfume grade oils may be also diluted about 80 to 95%. And then grade D is a floral waters. Okay, there's absolutely no therapeutic value in there whatsoever. It's or aromatic only, and it's mostly a byproduct of the grade A distillation. So after all the oil is pulled out of the grade A, the leftover aromatic water is sold and companies can purchase this aromatic water. Um, typically they add 5% of the floral water in the body and then uh, in the bottle, and then the rest is going to be made with other cheap carriers. And they can even, even label it pure, which is just unnerving. So you really do have to be careful um, with that, okay? So let's talk about um, the modern day distillation. Although people have been growing, harvesting, and distilling essential oil botanicals for thousands of years, Gary Young knew he needed to improve these existing systems if he were going to accomplish his goal of bringing essential oils to the world. With the natural differences between crops of botanicals, Gary made many adjustments and modified his system according to what he observed. The early years of harvesting botanicals and distilling essential oils brought about many changes, transforming the process from traditional, familiar approaches to new, innovative, and much more efficient production methods. And I'm on the job bringing the best balsam oil in the world to you. That's really cool. So he has, although he has studied all around the world and ancient methods of distillation, um, as well as some modern day, he has really brought so many advances to the distillation process. It's absolutely amazing. Gary is the one who would get into a distillation condenser and, and, and stand in there and tell his employees to turn it on so he can see which way the air is flowing to see, you know, what would be happening. And I, I don't know any other founder that would go through those lengths to be able to understand the process of what is happening to the plant and have the desire to just perfect it so much. It's, 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 it's truly amazing. He, he definitely is an innovator and they continue to um, innovate so many, um, so many things with their uh, huge laboratory and all the practices that they do today. Okay, so seed to seal. You know, there are two reasons why I chose Young Living over all the other essential oil companies. One, of course, they produce grade A oils. And two, they are the only company in the world with a seed to seal, seed to seal promise. Seed to seal is a promise of integrity and transparency. Gary Young has said he never makes an oil a product for a profit. He makes it for a purpose. Seed to seal means that each plant is hand weeded. There are no pesticides, chemicals, or weed killers. The plants are harvested at their peak. They're then brought through a vigorous testing process, both internally and by a third party. And upon passing all the tests, which are done in triplicate many times over, they're bottled, sealed, and sent to your home. So seed to sale is definitely not a slogan, it is promise. And I really encourage you to learn more about the seed to seal at seedtoseal.com. And I encourage you to even learn more about our founder, D. Gary Young, and you can do that at dgaryyoung.com. So do your research for sure. Okay. So Young Living Essential Oils can provide support from head to toe, internally and externally. They can support every body system, cardiovascular, muscular, respiratory, endocrine, nervous, digestive, in, in, integumentary, 
excretory, they can support your hormones, brain health, healthy weight. They can use it, be used extensively for physical, emotional, and spiritual purposes, which is absolutely amazing. You know, an oil in a diffuser can soothe a child's tough day at school and provide that calming effect when you've had a really stressful day at work. Um, they are found in the bloodstream, there we go, found in the bloodstream in 26 seconds after being applied topically. And expulsion of essential oils usually takes about three to six hours in a normal healthy body. If you're working on something pretty tough, then you're probably going to, um, it's going to hang on to that oil just a little bit longer. So keeping this information in mind, how do you think, how important do you think it is to use only clean, toxin-free, grade A essential oils? It's pretty, pretty important. Um, so ha do you have any idea, let's see, um, how powerful your sense of smell actually is? Well, our your olfactory nerve is wired directly into the limbic part of your brain. And your limbic part controls your heart rate, blood pressure, breathing, stress level, memory, hormone balance, and emotions. Simply inhaling a Young Living essential oil can have a powerful and positive effect on all of these. It is amazing, absolutely amazing. And anybody can use essential oils and I've used them on my pets. I've used them on, I have five kids, I've used them on them. I've used them on, um, obviously my husband and I use them like I'll, I'll um, for many different um, reasons. I use them on my chickens, on my cat. <laughs> I'm trying to think of all the other ways I use them. So many, many different ways we use them each and every day. And there are different ways to use essential oils. So we're going to talk about um, the three methods, okay? So inhalation, all right? Inhalation, basically, you would put a drop of essential oil on your palm of your hand, okay? You can actually take your hand and go clockwise five times to bring up the frequency of the essential oil. And then you just basically cup it over your nose and mouth and just inhale. So that is inhalation. You can also put it in a diffuser and diffusers are absolutely amazing. We have them going around the house. And if you, um, the Young Living diffuser is a especially effective because it suspends the molecules in the air the maximum amount of time. So if you have a high priced, you know, uh, pure essential oil, you definitely want to get the most benefit out of those molecules. So I love that. So topically, basically you can put it on your skin and you uh, can use a carrier oil or you can put it on neat. Okay. Neat means you put it directly onto your skin. All right. You can also take it internally. Um, those capsules that are shown there um, are just ve veggie capsules and you can load up your essential oils. You can also put a carrier in there. Um, I know for my pet, um, I like to put some of the Vitality oils in there, but also put enough carrier um, to dilute the essential oils. Um, and then I can give him a capsule for us, and not, I don't always put in carrier oils. A lot of times it's just a lot of essential oils in there. So um, it's absolutely amazing. You can also just put the Vitality oils and those Vitality oils we'll talk about in a minute. Basically those are designated for ingestion. You can see the white label here of the lemon on my screen. These are verified non-GMO project which is great. We have so many. I think our Vitality line, definitely over 40, but I think it's more like 50 or so. And these citrus oils are wonderful. Use them in my kombucha. Use them for um, making dishes. I never have a fresh lemon or lime in my refrigerator anymore because they would always um, get bad and it's hard to find organic ones of those. And so um, I absolutely love, love um, 
uh, using those vitality oils. So you can absolutely use them in cooking and um, they're designated for consumption only. So I, I love that. All right, let's move on to talking about very specific oils. The ones that we're gonna run through here are the ones that are provided in a premium starter kit. When I first started, I had no idea where to begin. And so the best thing that I found was a starter kit. Not only did it have the oils that I would use on an everyday basis, but um, it also was so economical. <laughs> so that's, a huge, huge reason is um, these oils that come in the kit are made affordable uh, for people to get started. So uh, let's start with Citrus Fresh. This actually is a great combination of so many of the different citrus oils put together. I love it in my water, um, but you can also put it in a diffuser. It smells divine. It's absolutely amazing. The only thing that you want to keep um, in mind, if you do put it on topically, is that you would not, with the citrus oils, want to put them on topically and then go out and garden for six hours because they are photosensitive. So just keep that in mind. Digize. Okay, this is the best one for the digestion. I love this. Ever since we started eating clean, I have to say, if I do eat something that is um, definitely not on the clean list, my body will revolt I'll be like hey no 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 you're not you're not putting that in and so i will take a drop of digize and i'll just put a drop on my tongue you could also put a drop on your stomach um, or on your um, esophagus as well and it is absolutely amazing i can pretty much set my clock like 20 minutes later my system is back in working order i absolutely love this so it has all the great um, oils, anise, ginger, fennel, uh, peppermint to really use for the digestion system. So I love that. Okay. All right. Let's move on to thieves. So a lot of people think that Young Living, oh yeah, that's that thieves company. Um, thieves is a whole line. There are so many products that use this very potent blend of oils, which is rosemary, cinnamon bark, eucalyptus, radiata, and lemon, and clove. And um, it's just, it's absolutely amazing. I cannot say enough about Thieves. This is for your immune system, and it helps maintain overall wellness and can be taken as a dietary supplement. It also can help support a healthy respiratory system when you diffuse it. And um, so you can see here that clearly we have an oil the Thieves darker one, and then the white labeled one, they actually are exactly the same, same oil. They just are labeled differently because they want to make sure this one, you know, with the dark covered label is for topical use and aromatic use. And the other one that is white is used for consumption. We are just trying to be compliant and so that is the reason why. Okay. Um, so let's move on to, oh, let me tell you about the winter wellness tea. Okay, this is kind of good anytime, especially since, you know, this season of yuckiness is ongoing and seems to be never ending. Um, but there is a great winter wellness tea that you can do. It's just one to two drops of Fee's Vitality, two to four drops of Lemon Vitality, and you put a tablespoon of um, of apple cider vinegar in there and put like a tablespoon of honey or maybe a little bit less raw honey, make sure it's raw honey. And you put it in with warm water, not boiling hot water, but um, just warm water. And it is amazing. So talk about a boost to your immune system. It's pretty, pretty cool. Okay. And lemon, I think we talked about that briefly. Basically, put it in your water. It's a great detoxifier. Also, if you have sticky stuff, yeah, that's it's amazing. You can put that on there, and it will actually just kind of scavenge for those petrochemicals and um, eliminate them, absorb them. It's crazy. I love it. Okay, I'm moving on to Thieves Hand Purifier and Thieves um, Household Cleaner. So, especially now, 
the hand purifier is is a necessity. I mean, anywhere you go. Um, but the thing that I love about this that's different is that it has none of the junk that all the other commercial ones have. And secondly, it is easy on the hands. So it does not dry out the hands. Uh, it's wonderful. I absolutely love it. Uh, the household cleaner, this is the only cleaner that we use in our house. It is highly, highly um, potent and ultra concentrated, highly effective. And it is a plant-based cleaner that actually works. And I use it on everything. And I don't have to like put on a hazmat suit and, and be in my enclosed bathroom with no windows and have to worry about any fumes. I can actually give it to my kids to clean and not have to worry about them um, inhaling or getting any um, toxic junk. So I love it. Okay, Ningxia Red. I cannot say enough about this energy drink. This is pretty much a head to toe overall wellness product. It is a delicious drink and is loaded with antioxidants. It gives you energy, it supports your liver, kidneys, eyes. It has a lot of zeaxanthin in it, and so it is excellent for your eyesight and great for your immune system. So I highly recommend you go to uh, ninksharead.com. There are so many videos up and would love for you to watch the video on Ningxia Red because our founder actually went over to the Ningxia region in China and discovered that those people were living well and living with um, gardens and living to be like 110, had none of our Western diseases. And he, he was like, what are you doing? And they said, oh, we have the wolfberry each day. And that is um, a lot of the basis for this product. Gary, of course, improved it and added so many antioxidant fruits like blueberry, plum, pomegranate, cherry. He also um, infused essential oils in there. So you have your orange and your lime and it's absolutely wonderful and totally delicious. We line up the shot glasses. Every one of my household takes it, including my five kids, and I never have to argue with them. They just take it. And I know on a cellular level, their cells are being cleaned. They are being infused with excellent nutrition. So I absolutely love it. Okay, peppermint. If I have to choose a few oils that are required to be in every household, it would be lavender, peppermint, and lemon, if those were the only three. Um, peppermint, we all know it's great for gastro gastrointestinal support. It um, promotes healthy bowel function and a healthy gut function. And we also use it for clarity, for um, getting energy, waking up, and you can also use it to cool your body system down. So if it is um, running a little bit hot, you can just put a drop of peppermint um, on the back of your neck and it's like this cooling system that goes down. It's absolutely amazing. So it's very potent. It is equal to about 28 cups of peppermint tea, um, but I do love using it in my smoothies, just one drop, um, using it in uh, my chocolate brownies. So I do cook with it frequently and absolutely love it. All right, peace and calming. This is definitely a member, member favorite. It is gentle, calming. It has a sweet aroma. It's, you can use it as a perfume. Um, you can definitely use it when you get a massage. It is, it is amazing. Uh, frankincense. Frankincense is one of those um, uh, top skin oils, okay? Just think um, anti-aging, okay? And this one is um, used in so many of our beauty products that we have at Young Living. So frankincense, this is, if it's kind of considered the coconut oil of essential oils, because there's over 10,000 uses for frankincense. And I, for one, when my kids come to me and I don't know what to do, I go to frankincense, all right? Because I know it will get the job done. All right, lavender, like it says, my top three. Lavender is really the oil of relaxation. You can diffuse it for a calming, soothing aroma. You can uh, use it for um, really just kind of calming down any areas on your skin that might be irritated by different things. I have four boys and every day something is happening. So, some, someone's bleeding or something is happening. Um, and so it is really great to just calm any of those areas down. Uh, great in the bath, great when you just need to get to sleep at night. You can put uh, a drop of lavender on your big toe, which corresponds to the sleep centers in your brain. And 
It's absolutely amazing. Pan away. So pan away used to be called pain away. We can't say pain. So now it's called pan away, kind of a weird name, but uh, this blend is actually wonderful for using after exercise and soothing, soothing the muscles. It has a very stimulating aroma with that wintergreen in there. And you can put it on your back and neck and it is so incredibly soothing. You can also use it to support your um, skin coloration. Okay, Raven. So this time in our in our history right now, this probably is one of the best oils to be using to support a healthy respiratory system. Okay, you can definitely diffuse it uh, for a com comforting aroma, but rubbing it on your feet or chest with a carry oil in times of need is amazing. Okay, so. Um, it, it, it has a lot of different uh, eucalyptus um, oils in it, species of oil in it. And I just, yeah, I love Raven. Stress away. Well, the name pretty much says it all. This is our top emotion oil. And it is a really important part of a daily health regimen. You know, we are so stressed out. There is so much happening in our world right now. And this is one of the tools that you can use on a daily basis to kind of calm down all the what is swirling around in your head just take a moment and have it's like having a portable spa that you can just like escape to so i absolutely love stress away it is amazing uh valor so valor is um probably one of the most popular products it is the courage oil. So the oils that are in this one was a blend put together by Gary Young um, because it was similar to the one that the gladiators, the Roman gladiators would use before going out to battle. So it is, it is definitely courage oil. I absolutely love it. You can also use it for perfumer cologne. It smells amazing. And it just really, when you're feeling emotionally down and out, it is, it is the best oil. Uh, I put this on here about this V6. This is a carrier oil. It basically has six vegetable oils in it. The reason why I love to tell people about it is because it is so easy with the pump to be able to work with uh, essential oils and have an easy pump of carrier oil. It is just life-saving. So it's just kind of a helpful tip. I just want to put in there. Okay. So a little bit, a little bit goes a long way. So I know that I'm almost done. Okay. okay. So um, I know that lavender um, over here, the dark colored bottle has um, 250 to 300 drops in it. That is the 15 mil. The one with the white label has 85 to 100 in it. And that is, um, that at one drop goes a really, really long way. Okay. Um, and same with the household cleaner. So you can actually make a green cleaner that would be a dollar and 17 cents. That is amazing. Like you can't get that anywhere. If you went and you bought, a, you know, maybe a premium green cleaner, it's nowhere close to a dollar, almost 20 a bottle. It, it's just, it's not, it's absolutely impossible to get that. So is very economical when people look at doing essential oils there's so many opportunities for diys so many state cost saving opportunities and it actually does not work out to be expensive it works out to be more economical than anything that you would be able to buy that's already pre-made and plus probably toxic for your body and your family okay so what is right for you so as far as young living go goes a wholesale membership is the best way because it's the most economical way. There are many reasons uh, why uh, to become a wholesale member, but probably the best is that you save 24% off of retail. And you also can participate in the Essential Awards program, which can give you up to 25% back into a bank each and every month. So the savings, if you add all of that up, is phenomenal. So for me, it's like, so um, I'm at 25% uh, right now with Essential Rewards. So it's getting close to 49% that I'm actually able to save and use on safe, pure products. 
you can definitely become a retail customer. Retail customers, they are going to order one product one time. It's not worth the investment to become a wholesale member if you're just going to order one product. But that is an option. You can absolutely do that. So here's a picture of the uh, starter kit. It does come with a diffuser. There are 12 oils in there. It also comes with the Thieves products, comes with the Ningxia Red samples in it. And it is amazing. It shows that for $8.75 per oil, you can have a starter kit. That's so crazy. That is really, really awesome. So it's $165 and it retails over 400. So it is a great, great deal. So for the serious oils, oilers that really want to get started now, you can definitely visit the um, ninjaoiler.com and pick up your premium starter kit today. Absolutely can do that. You can also text SAVE to 321-438-3237. You'll get a direct link um, to be able to fill out a form and be able to make that purchase. So choose the, choose the path that is right for you. Okay, here are some great resources. You can find me on Facebook, Everyday Oils with Julie. Uh, again, here's my website, the ninjaoiler.com slash classroom, where you can find there's many audio classes available. You can actually take um, essential oils 101 through 106 on there. Many different ones. There's also a CBD class that's really good. You can find me on YouTube. There are many videos being posted um, daily on there. So check that out. And there are other resources for a reference guide. Highly recommend getting one. Uh, if you do become a member, I bless you with one, and that is through discoverlsp.com. It's really easy um, and portable. You can use it right on your phone. If you want to do extensive research, uh, medical research, you can go to pubmed.gov. Okay, so thank you so much for joining me tonight. I uh, wish you a very blessed wellness journey, and make sure that you contact me if you want to get started today. Take care.